Hi, my name is Sloan and I'm a student here at Presbyterian College in the Occupational Therapy Doctoral Program. Presbyterian College, also known as PC around here, was founded in 1880. It's known for its rigorous academics and offers over 90 undergraduate programs and three graduate programs in the health sciences. Bailey Hall was originally a freshman residence hall. It has recently renovated to become the home of the Occupational Therapy Doctoral Program. And that means the entire building is dedicated to the OTD program. Let's take a look. Here we have our Environmental Simulation Center where students can work with clients in an emulated home setting and work on activities of daily living, such as working in the laundry room or working in a mock grocery store. We also have an ATM, a living center area, a kitchen area, a bedroom type setting to work on those skills to help them to integrate back into the community. Oh hey, let me pull over. So one of the many amenities that our state-of-the-art facility has is a driver's rehabilitation program. Here we have a driver simulation lab that focuses on assessing the skills of clients and helping them to get back into their community and drive safely while doing it. So I'll see you on the road. Now we're in what has to be one of my favorite rooms in the building. It's the Neuro Rehabilitation Lab, where we use interventions, tools, and assessments from, for clients ranging from pediatrics all the way to geriatrics. And we may implement a sensory swing or even things such as alignment for the upper extremity, lower extremity. We may look at shoulder rehabilitation, gait training, transfers from maybe even a bed to a chair, and looking at stroke body positioning and all of which are applicable to real world learning and our future practice as occupational therapists. Here we're in the orthopedic lab, where we focus more on the physical rehabilitation through the use of strengthening exercises, range of motion, physical agent modalities such as fluidotherapy, ultrasound, and the TENS unit. Other assessments we may use are grip strength, we may use monofilament and measurements with a goniometer, which you may see in an outpatient clinic with an occupational therapist. One of the reasons why I chose PC's occupational therapy doctoral program is the student to faculty ratio it happens to be five to one. The lab ratio 15 to one, allowing us students to have a more personalized assistance whenever we may need. If we're not understanding an assignment or a concept, our professors are willing to help whenever that may be. And they have that open door policy allowing us to ask them questions all the time throughout the day. And in fact, Dr. Turpin's teaching right now, so let's go see what we're learning. Another great class, learning more about occupational therapy and what it means to be a practitioner. Although Bailey Hall is just dedicated to our doctoral program, we also have access to other buildings on campus, such as the Spring Student Center, where you can come, grab a bite to eat, maybe get some PC gear, and just hang out with friends when you need to. Well, that's it for our virtual tour. Thanks for following along. I hope to see you for an in-person visit soon and that you learned more about PC's Occupational Therapy Doctoral Program.